cross for you. He died on the cross for your sins. So you no more have to suffer either. All you need to do is give yourself to Jesus with your whole heart and your whole soul. Invite him into your heart to live inside your heart. And then repent. Repent of all your sins. And then repent every day because sometimes we think, mm, well, we haven't done a sin. But in God's eyes, you might have done a sin. So you'd best to pray and repent every day. Because there's only one way into heaven and that's through Jesus Christ. One day you're going to die and you're only either going to go to heaven or hell. Wouldn't you prefer to go to heaven? I know I would. I have given myself to Jesus a number of years ago. But it's only now I'm getting closer to him. You know, he's going to come back. And you wake up tomorrow and he comes back. Or he came back right now. Wouldn't you want to go with him up into the clouds, up into heaven, to his kingdom? I wouldn't want to be stuck here on the earth. There's so many bad things are going to happen. It'll be just tragic and horrible. But we celebrate Jesus' death on the cross because on the third day he rose again and he spent 40 days again on the earth. He, he rose again. He healed people again. Not just the first time, but after he rose, he healed again. And then he left for the final time after the 40th day to rise again to sit on the right hand side of the Father. And that's where he remains today. And he's here to help us. He loves you so much. He loves you more than we can ever, ever, ever understand. We can't comprehend how much he loves us, honestly. Please, please follow the Lord Jesus. Give yourself to him. Repent. You will never regret it. Because he loves you. I wish you all a very happy Easter to celebrate the Lord's death, but he's rising on the third day and he lives, he lives today, he's alive right now. Glory to God. <laughs>